Hello you guys, uh, today we're going to do a programming for uh, for VET C8 with the uh, key looking like that but it will be for all the keys it looks like that um, I'm going to show you how to do it from in and out so to launch the dealer tool we're just going to launch it from Google Chrome but we're going to be using the TechLine Connect so we're just going to go to AC Delco TDS and when you get here you're just going to log into your AC Delco account so I'm just going to log into mine and I'm just going to put the verification code that they've been sending me and we're just going to do log in after when we are here, we're just gonna scroll all the way down. We're gonna hit I have read, we're gonna hit agree. And then here, you're gonna need to buy the subscription, but uh, we should have here a subscription ready to go. So you're gonna hit view. After you bought one subscription, you're going to do Advin. And now it looks like it's launching. So we just fixed our internet problem, so now it's going to launch the TLC. I'm going to put the car in on position, so we're just going to press the push to start for 12 seconds. On. So you see it off. So after you get to this interface, sorry for the blurriness. So on this screen, we're just gonna enter the VIN right here. We're just gonna hit select. So it shows us the car. And then we can go here and press the SP2 to load this. And then here we're gonna leave it and reprogram. And we're gonna hit the next right here. I have a lot of sun on my screen so I barely see it. Sorry about that guys. After I read the vehicle data, we're just going to go to Immobilizer Learn, which is right here. Sorry about that. I don't know what was it. So when you're going to press Immobilizer Learn, you can just hit Next, right here in the bottom. So here it's going to tell us that it's going to take uh, one of the VIN slots, which it's okay. It's going to cost 45 bucks each VIN uh, to buy uh, from them. And I think you can buy more maybe for a lower rate. But basically it gives you 24 uh, months of, uh, or I think 24 months of uh, subscription to the AC Delco website. And this is where we get in, got in from. And here we're just gonna go program transponder or remote key. And we're gonna do add, so we're just adding a key. And then we're just gonna hit next. Please make sure the ignition is on, engine is off. Um, if it's an all key loss, so you're just gonna do what it does, tells you here. So we're just gonna hit next on that. Please close driver door and place next. We're just gonna hit next on that. And now it's gonna be the timer uh, going by 
is that 12 minutes of wait. So we're just gonna wait with that and we're gonna be with you uh, when we get closer to the end of this counting. Okay, so you guys, uh, 10 minutes uh, almost passed. Uh, we have the new key. We can already place it in the back bottom of the cup holder. And again, you can find that on the owner manual on every GM model. Very simple, they show you a picture of that. So we're just gonna wait for that to finish. So a number of keys learned is two. Uh, you do, would you like to learn the keys? We're just gonna hit the yes on the bottom over there. Insert the key into the slot and press next. Press the push start button. So we're just gonna press the push start button. And ready for key three. And we can press the push start button once. And we can try to see. And I hit next. So it doesn't get the key, so we're just gonna try it again. So we place the key on the back of the bottom cup holder. And we're gonna hit yes. Insert the new key and we're gonna hit yes. Press the start button. And we're gonna push the push start. And we're gonna hit next. Wait for three seconds. Insert the new key and press the push button. Okay, ready for key number four. So we placed it on the front cup holder and it seems like it's got it. So we can do a small test and see that it's already learned. I always like to do that because if not, you want to stay in programming so you can do the next one. So we don't want to do more keys. We're just going to hit no down there. And we're going to play, press the push start for 16 seconds. See how it says learning key complete over there on the right. I'm just gonna wait a couple more seconds and we're gonna let go and we're gonna hit next here. Now we're just gonna wait 15 seconds and now we're gonna wait another six seconds and then one more waiting. So we can shut the ignition off. He wants us to open and close the driver doors. Um, we're not gonna do that, obviously. It's a uh, modified doors. And I don't feel like doing that now. So we're just gonna hit next. And we're gonna wait a minute and a half. Uh, but basically, this is how uh, you guys can uh, perform all the new GM style keys that look like this knife shape, but kind of the, that will be the easier, faster, reliable solution. Uh, just make sure you have a good internet connection. The V200 will be good for Ford and GM for this manner. Uh, good thing about GM that you can just uh, purchase the AC Delco, but you don't need to uh, provide the D1 for each vehicle. And the Ford, I think you will need. So it's a good benefit about that. And again, I'm sorry for the blariness and uh, 
the sun being on the screen, it's hard for me to see as well. I'm just trying to give you guys uh, overlook of how it's being done and the easiest way. When you guys think about dealer tool, you can be afraid, but technically it's maybe easier than the aftermarket ones in many, many ways. So that will be the end of it. And we're just gonna make sure everything works correctly before we shut it off. So the immobilizer uh, complete, we can hit next. And then please check if the engine start which is key, so we can basically take this key. Sit in the vehicle, press the brake, and again with the wing doors. It's just beautiful. And we can see that the immobilizer light on the top goes away. Um, so the key is uh, completely done. This is how you're going to do uh, those systems from GM. I will see you guys in the next car. Have a good day. And thank you guys for watching.